what's going on guys how are you how are you doing this is shocks and this is shocks capital fx youtube channel today i'm back i want to show you this pattern that occurs on volatility 75 1s that is found on deriv.com and if you want to get an account the links are in the description down below you can just scroll down get your account and get ready to be trading with these uh, money making indices right so this is volatility 75 1s what you are uh, looking at at this particular point is called a flag pattern so this pattern um is regular on the m5 chart on the v75 1s so we're going to be looking at it and we're going to be looking at the times that this particular pattern occurs and how you can take advantage of this pattern right so number one you have to identify the what we call this the pole right and this the flag right so this is the pole and this is the flag so when you enter you need to be conscious of uh, the length of the pole because that is going to be what you take profit if you get this trade right right so if you enter here you're going to enter there so the difference uh with any other flag pattern here is the end with any other flag pattern you can you, you you remember that you are told that you wait for the break and retest then you go but with this strategy i'm going to show you another entry pattern that uh, lets you get your entry at this particular point as you can see uh my arrow there so this is what you're going to be doing so number one you wait for what you wait for what for open right then you wait for price to make an anchor expansion move as you can see in this one in this picture then after making an expansion move you wait for it to make a what to make a flag pattern like this as you can see in this one in this picture so what you want to be seeing is if you want to go up if you want to buy you are going to be looking for the what for the third touch of this uh, lower trend line here as you can see you see this is number two and this is number three so you are going to be getting your entries at this particular touch on this what on this trend line so after price touches or retest this trend line you are going to get your buys there and your stop loss is just going to go below that trend line and you're going to use that as your what as your entry so i'm just going to give you three things that you should watch out for when you trade uh this particular pattern number one remember i said an anchor so an anchor can be your what can be um a double top a double bottom it can be a triple top a triple bottom or it can be a head and shoulder pattern right so in this case we have what a double bottom right so after this double bottom is confirmed by break of what of this neckline right here this is where you start looking for what for your flag pattern so as you can see this trend line uh retest is closer to this one to this flip zone that price created here by breaking the what the neckline so what you are going to be doing here is putting your stop loss just below the this yellow zone that i marked here so sorry this is the third touch this is the yellow zone so this is where your stop loss is just going to go depending on how big your account is then you go up so what you'll be doing is you'll be anticipating the what the break of this what of this trend line as price is what is moving up like that so as price breaks here you just measure from this break after this candle right here as you can see after this candlestick right here you measure from here to what to the next zone where uh, using the pole here as your what of as your reference and this is going to be what your, your take profit right this is going to be your take profit and you're going to be taking your profit at this particular point whatever happens after that you are not what um first and you don't care what uh, actually happens there so let's let's look at another example where we can see uh this pattern unfolding and how we can take advantage of this so it can be there is an anchor here that was formed right there is an anchor then there is this pattern that you can clearly see here this is the flag right this is the flag and remember we want to go up so what are we waiting for we are going to be waiting for what for the third touch to our trend line here so this is the what the third touch going to uh here right and as you can see you can't ignore that you have this order block right here in this what in this area so that order block is going to be guiding you in putting your what your stop loss below here and where is your pole this is going to be your pole and after break here you measure that and this is going to be what 
you take profit and you measure as you go and you take your profit at that particular point so let's look at another example so that you guys can actually uh, internalize this and use it in your trading so this is a sale example where prices has been going down right so remember before we go any further this is a continuation pattern right you're not going to be using this forward for reversals you use this when the reversal has been confirmed already and this is going to be a continuation pattern that you are going to be taking advantage of and that you are going to be looking for right so after this we have one two three touches to our trend line this is the third touch and where is our pole our pole is this move right here you measure it from that and this is the pole and the tech profit you see how easy it is and uh let's look at the this the, this is uh this happened today right so what do we have we have this pole then we have these three touches to the what to the trend line number touch number one touch number two and touch number three so this is what is happening right here right now on this particular chart so what do you do you enter at this third touch and you what you target this one this uh length of this pole and that's what you are going to be doing here so this is uh uh, a flag pattern so let's go back to what to to this particular or to this first example where we are having all the elements that we have so i'm just going to run down everything that you need to do but before i do that i just want to uh tell you that if you are new to these indices they are found on deriv and the links are in the description down below for you to get your account and start trading with my strategies that you can find on this one on this uh youtube channel and on my telegram the links are also in the description down below you can find everything you need to trade with me and to trade with deriv so the best broker and the best indices so this is what you are going to be doing so let's just give you a summary of what we are going to be doing uh with this strategy so number one what do you need you need an anchor as you can see that's rule number one number two you need a break of a what of a neckline that's number two after a break of a neckline you need an exhaustion of what of this trend remember this was the trend this is exhaustion phase after it is uh exhausted like that you look for a pattern that we are calling a what a flag and you are going to be looking for what we call a three touch to the trend line so you draw your trend line like what i'm showing you on this screen and you do not enter at the break and the retest phase here you do not get your entry here right that that would be too late and that would be that would pose problems in uh putting your stop losses and setting your what your your stops right so you're going to be getting your trade at this particular time at this touch to the trend line this is where your entry is going to be and you're going to go up and i want just to to show you for those who have gotten this far on this video if you can see a fair value gap in this area right if you can see a fair value gap in this area it means that uh it is added confirmation for your what for your entry right so this would be your fair value gap right this will be your trend line and this will be your entry and this is a very good sign for you to enter a trade so it would be uh smart on your end that you look for this fair value gap and this what and this retest then you can get this trade so this is the flag pattern that you can use for your trades a uh, continuation trades the advantages of this is the trend is already defined right the trend is already defined and the what the direction is already known so what you just have to do is look for an entry um, almost a guaranteed entry because you have your buyers in the bag you have a direction in the bag i hope this was helpful guys i will see you in the next video remember to trade what you see trade with deriv deriv the best broker with the best indices in the market so see you in the next video cheers trade what you see hands to the head salute